time with your dog to introduce the halty head collar will ensure you get the best results when trying to improve your dog's pulling behaviour. At first, your dog may slightly object to wearing the halty head collar. Here are some of our handy hints to make the process more fun. Show your dog the halty head collar and allow him to sniff it. At the same time, give him a treat so that he associates it with a positive experience. Next, start to treat your dog through the noseband of the head collar. Then, slide the halty head collar over your hand and onto the dog's nose. Once your dog is calm with the head collar on his nose, gently do up the neck strap and adjust the fit. You can practice this a few times. Then, attach the safety link to his collar. It is especially important for the initial period that your dog wears a halty head collar that the safety link is attached. If your dog removes the head collar during training, this ensures your dog does not get loose and run off. Finally, attach your lead to the halty head collar using the ring underneath the dog's jaw. We would always recommend that you use a double clip lead, such as the halty training lead. This will enable you to train your dog more effectively, as you can use his normal collar attachment whilst he is walking to heel, and only use the head collar to correct the pulling behaviour. Take your dog for a walk in the garden or a quiet place and walk your dog around using the head collar to guide the dog in the direction that you choose. If your dog tries to remove the head collar by pawing at it, distract him with your voice and treats. Never tell your dog off for trying to remove the head collar, this will only create a negative association with wearing it. Now, take your dog on a short walk and continue the walking to heel training by changing direction, asking for stops and moving forward at your own pace. Keep up the distraction treating as needed. Build up to longer walks in your usual walking places, including scenarios where your dog is most likely to pull, such as meeting other dogs and crossing roads. Eventually, as a final step, you should walk your dog without the halty head collar on to check that he has learned to walk nicely to heel. If your dog's pulling behaviour relapses, introduce the halty head collar again as necessary.